So in this problem, we're told that if m is less than or equal to f of x, which is less than or equal to capital M, for a, which is less than or equal to x, which is less than or equal to b, where m is the absolute minimum and capital M is the absolute maximum of f on the interval from a to b, then we have this uh, formula right here, and we're going to use this to solve. And we're told to use this pro property to estimate the value of the interval. So how do we do this? So basically, what we're going to be solving for is lowercase m of b minus a and uppercase m times b minus a. Let's start by finding what b minus a is. So they tell us that this is going to be b and this is a. We have those two values, right? So it's basically the same thing. So b is going to be 4, a is going to be 0. And so we can find what b minus a is for each of these. So m times um, 4 minus 0 is just going to be 4. And then so this one's going to be uppercase m times 4. But what is lowercase m and uppercase m? So we find those by doing this. So we know that lowercase m is the absolute minimum of our, um, from our function here. So it's going to be 0, right? So we're going to take at 0 and then plug it into our function to find m. So if we plug in 0 into this, we'll get 3 over 1 plus 0 squared, which equals 3 over 1, which is just 3. So that means m is going to be equal to 3. So this is just going to become 3 times 4. What about uppercase m? So it's going to be the maximum on our interval, so 4. So we want to take 4 and plug it in. So to find m, we do 3 over uh, 1 plus 4 squared. 3 over 1 plus 4 squared. 4 squared is 16. Plus 1 is going to be 17. So we have 3 over 17. So we have 3 over 17 times 4 then. And so now we can just calculate. So 3 times 4 is going to be 12. So one of our values is going to be 12. And the other one's going to be 3 times 4 is 12 over 17. 12 over 17. So one of our values is 12. One of them is 12 over 17. So we put the smaller value here. So this one's going to be 12 over 17. And our larger value is going to be 12. And so these right here are going to be our answers. And this is going to be how you solve this problem.